All right, guys, it's Brian with Be Little Fishing here. We are headed out to do some fishing in the rain. I've got the little men right back there, trailing behind me. We don't do a lot of fishing in the rain, but we're going to see if we can't catch a few. And we're going to bring you along. All right, guys, so we are out here in the rain and the crazy wind. I've got this Mondo on that I had on last night. I think I'm just gonna leave it for now. I'm gonna cast a little bit. See if there's not something out there that wants to hit it. Croppy jig somebody dropped didn't get that picked up try to always pick up trash leave the area you're in a little better than you left it I think that was for sure bluegills. <laughs> On the way home, we're going to be getting some pumpkin spice lattes and hot chocolates, I think. Look at that! Good job, Wiley! Is it a sunfish? Yeah. Good job, buddy! That's awesome. That's so awesome. Come out in the rain, getting soaking wet. Hooked up on a fish. It's been about two minutes of his first cast. When we first got here, the water was so windy and choppy now it's a little more calm it's just raining but he had me tie on a small hook for him and a bobber so he could put on some like little power bait crappie nibbles because he likes catching the sunfish and i thought he was gonna strike out big time and he caught the first fish that's awesome that definitely Man, I stopped that worm. I was slow rolling it. I stopped it just because I thought that's when the fish will pick it up. I started cranking it again. And then bam, 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 bam. They're pecking at that tail. I just tied on this Terminator spinnerbait. It's kind of a bluegill color. It's got a nice big gold willow leaf blade and then a little silver willow leaf blade the secondary I'll try to put something out there that's got a little action to it and see if we can't get some actual bass to strike versus those little bluegill any luck buster any bites um, right in front of me I got it it yeah yeah, I've had a few bluegill bites. Got it. Well, I caught something. Terminator jig snagged a yum baits bag. <clears throat> Green pumpkin chartreuse. Well, at least I know that's not mine. Any more bites, buddy? Yeah, I guess so. I'll let it go, but it, so let's it down to like half a second. 
Yeah. To keep working it. So I switched up to a smaller worm, smaller profile. It's five inch stick bait. It's the KVD, Strike King KVD Amistad Special. Pretty nice color pattern. Starting to sprinkle again. I think we'll probably call it. You guys about ready? All right, last cast. One more. Last cast. Well, guys, we had a great time this evening. It was raining pretty good as we got here, and the wa the wind was blowing so much that there was little white caps on the water, something we've never walked into before, pond fishing. So that was a first. Uh, did get pretty wet. Our hands are pretty numb from uh, being out in the, the rain, just the cold. It's only about 50 degrees, and whenever you add rain on top of that, it's pretty darn cold out there. So, um, one fish tonight. That was Wiley brought in the, I don't know if it was a sunfish or a bluegill. He said it was a real tan color, but um, the the bluegill or sunfish in this pond tend to be pretty washed out in color. So it's, it's hard to tell sometimes, but he caught the only fish. So go Wiley. Uh, I had a bunch of nibbles on the Mondo worm, John Austin had a bunch of nibbles. Um, just nothing would come up and just really take the worm today. So we're gonna keep trying again. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. After you hit the subscribe button, click the notification bell. That way you get notified every time a new video comes out. If you wanna see the gear that we use on a day-to-day -day basis, there'll be links for that in the description below. Hope you have a great day.